And what do you think of my physique, Dana? Do you even lift, bro? Skinny. Get the camera out of my face. How dare you? <laughs> This is A Fitness, and I'm here with my quest for a bigger chest. Progress week 11. For the past few weeks, I feel that I have been blabbing on about sometimes useless information that you guys might not want to hear about. So this week, I'm going to make this short, concise, and to the point. So just before I start this video, make sure next Tuesday to check out the upload I'm going to put up of an abs workout and in that video I'm going to tell you about a few ideas I have that I'd like to propose to you because I'd love to know your opinion but more on that on Tuesday's video. So this week I'm going to tell you how I feel about my physique, I'm going to tell you about my calories, my strength and also generally just what's been happening in the week. Okay so this week I weighed in this morning on an empty stomach at 171.3 pounds and last week I weighed in at 171.1 pounds so this week I have increased but it was only by 0.2 of a pound <sighs> but that means this week I've been eating 4,100 calories but I'm going to increase it to 4,200 calories because as you know I'd like to hit 190 to 200 pounds by September so whenever I don't increase by 0.5 of a pound at a minimum I'm going to increase my calories so 4,200 calories bring it on so as you've seen in my videos this week I've had a bit of a cold and I got that last Saturday and it's kind of been affecting my workouts and also I did six workouts this week this was because on Sunday I worked out because I thought as I had an exam the next day uh, I wouldn't be able to work out but then I had a massive gap between the exam and the next lecture so I decided to go and work out anyway and I find doing six workouts with the high volume I like to incorporate that my body has just become very tired I mean I don't feel too bad I think it's the cold and the high amount of training I've done this week it's just made me feel a bit rubbish and under the weather so next week I'm going to make sure I do the five days a week and take the weekend off and get back into a routine. So just quickly I got results back this week from my anatomy viva I told you about and I did the MCQ exam for psychology and I got 82% in the viva and I got 86% in the MCQ so two passes pretty well so I'm happy with that. Just got in there in time before the light turned off. My strength this week has been pretty mediocre because of how I've been feeling. But my PRs this week with my squats, I did 110 kilograms for five sets of five. My first session, I could I could only do 112 kilogram, 112 and a half kilograms for five sets of three. So that was pretty rubbish. And then with my bench press, I've had a bit of a form change because in previous videos you've seen when I bench pressed, I've had a big arch in my back and also my hips have been lifting off the bench. So I've reined that back in. I still do have a little bit of an arch in my back, but I'm really focusing on just pushing with my chest because the whole point of this bulk is to get a bigger chest. And then I hit a PR with my deadlifts this week on Monday. I hit 150 kilos for five sets of four. And previously I'd only done five sets of three with 150 kilos. So that's a big PR for me, but my back was torn up for the next three, four days as you probably know when you do deadlifts. So I hope you enjoyed that quick update. I'm gonna get on with the posing for you guys. Hope you enjoy.
hope you enjoyed that quest for a bigger chest. Progress week 11. I'm happy with how my physique looks at the moment, so I'm going to continue with what I'm doing. As I said at the start of the video, make sure you check in for Tuesday's upload of my ab workout because there's a lot of information that's going to be coming at you in that video. Be sure to like, comment, share, subscribe. Have a wonderful day guys and I'll see you in the next video. And keep making gains.